What's going on guys, I'm your boy Sully and today I am back bringing you another episode of Sully on Sundays. If you don't know what this is, it is my weekly vlogging series where I sit down for 5-10 to ten minutes every week, talk about life, how things are going um, and just pretty much update you guys on how my week has gone. Uh, not that many people care but you know I've been doing it for a while and will continue to do so but yeah I am currently dying. It is very very hot again and um, it's been a good week, it has been a very very good week. Um, to start things off, my girlfriend came over, uh, she was here till Wednesday and um, yeah, it was really fun. We took, went out to London, uh, did loads of touristy stuff and then she went shopping um, and then we just came back here, watched Stranger Things finally actually very good I didn't get to finish the first season though because uh, we ended up going to bed quite early but yeah um, the f so the first three days of the week up until Wednesday spent with my girlfriend we just relaxed uh, watched um, re-watched American Horror Story again um, just because I wanted to really get into it and I've seen part of the first season and nothing else of it but yeah start watching that as well um, too hot for life right now. Um, but then on Wednesday, I went and met, uh, went, saw and met Blink 182. This is why I now have a flag in my room. Um, but yeah, I went up to Leeds with my mate Vic and um, we met Blink 182, which is absolutely incredible. We got VIP tickets, we got this VIP lanyard thing. So we got to see their sound check um, and then we got like early entry merch um, and then obviously we got to see him live we got a picture taken with him um, and honestly so so good um, I explained last week I think Blink are one of the like first bands that got me into this sort of music in terms of listening to it they're an incredible band they're the only reason that me and Vic ever started talking or even became friends and the funny part about it is that it was like the day after our seventh anniversary of being friends on Facebook, which is actually quite cool. Um, shame it wasn't the day after, but you know, that would have been a pretty cool way to do seven years. Um, but yeah, uh, the show was awesome. I held Vic up in a crowd surf, um, just literally incredible. So needed. Um, and if you do have any like favorite bands or artists that you would love to go and see i'd highly recommend doing it um as soon as possible or whenever possible because it's one of the best feelings and best experiences you can get as someone who really enjoys music and listens to as much as i do it was like oh, just so so good so worth the money um so like incredible like oh, i don't even know words can't describe the feeling um had a conversation with one of the members, Mark Hoppus, who was like the person who got me into bass and just an incredibly all round good dude. <clears throat> yeah, I had a conversation with him. He chilled with all of the fans for like 20 minutes whilst they were prepping things for the photos and stuff like that. And oh, there's no words, no words for how good it is as a feeling, as an experience overall. Just oh, so, so good. But then, Came back from Leeds on Thursday, got a train like six, oh, was it Thursday? Yeah, saw Blink on Wednesday, then got a coach back at 6 a.m. on the Thursday, because um, I had a bank appointment, needed to sort out a student account finally, which I should have done last year, but didn't. Um, and then, what else did I do? Yeah, sorted out the bank account, came home, relaxed, drank a lot, um, yeah, and for the past like three days since, I've literally just been drinking. Um, went to a mate's house last night and broke my toe um, because I was very, very drunk and I was like diving off of his patio for literally no reason because I'm a mess. Um, but yeah, cool breaking your toe the day before you got on holiday. Um, not going to be ideal with the plane and air pressure and all of that shit. Um, <coughs> But, yeah, I like woke up this morning at like half eight after being completely 
paralytic and comatose and um, yeah I had a broken toe I didn't remember it happening I didn't actually feel any pain until I tried walking on my foot it was just not an ideal experience so I should be should have been going to my mate's gig now or Vic's gig now and I won't be able to because I have a broken toe and I still have to pack for this holiday even though we leave in like 12 hours or something or we'll be at the airport in 12 hours which is ridiculous so I do pretty much need to sort out my life uh, work out what I'm doing myself um, I need to pack shower um, tidy myself up a bit uh, what else do I have to do <clears throat> yeah go to Vic's later on tonight try to get a couple of hours sleeping and then getting a coach at 4.20 in the morning to Stansted Airport from Victoria and that's, that should be fun that should be eventful um, and then we're flying out at about half eight-ish I think um, get to Madrid for about 12 um, drop our shit off at the hotel or Airbnb and then go and explore for a bit should be a very good holiday I'm excited to go Madrid to see I've always wanted to go to and then we're also doing Berlin after 10 days in Madrid so it should be a good holiday it'll be a nice break um, from England for a bit um, but yeah that sums it up for me really like one of the best weeks I've had in a long long time spending days with my girlfriend which we don't get to do often because obviously her living in Wigan and me living in Egham um, distance is a bit of a cunt but life um, and then obviously seeing Blink was just literally no words um, but yeah apologies for this being short if you can tell I'm a bit of a mess at the moment pretty much all over the place and I have a lot to do so that's gonna wrap it up from me um, just again incredible incredible week um, and then next week I will be recording these we have Wi-Fi at the hotel um, so we will be able to get Sunday and Sundays up again um, oh man I don't know how I'm gonna cope in Madrid with the heat because uh, I can barely deal with England at the moment and Madrid's going to be a lot hotter I imagine so that should be fun to deal with and yeah whatever um, but yeah that wraps it up I hope you guys did enjoy it as always if you did then do be sure to leave a like and all of that jazz um, and yeah apologies again for like lack of content and not being able to upload other things at the moment my PC is still fucked PlayStation I haven't touched in like a week or so um but I will be live streaming when I get back um a lot more because I get back and then like 10 days later I move into my house um which will be pretty cool so hopefully we can get internet set up there ASAP hopefully I can sort my PC out um and I'll be able to live stream which is kind of what I want to do for like the majority of summer when I get back um just sort of build up a fan base for next year and things like that um but yeah i've been your boy sully this has been sully on sundays episode 117 and yeah if you did enjoy like i said do be sure to leave a like comment subscribe all of that jazz i've been your boy sully and 